This is the same calcite ROM I used in the previous video to demonstrate fluorescence in a mineral sample. In that video, I used a near UV wavelength of 405 nanometers to excite the sample and we saw several interesting phenomena. The optical properties of this calcite sample causes double refraction or birefringence of the laser beam. This can be seen by the beam splitting into two separate paths inside the crystal. Often we associate fluorescence with ultraviolet or near ultraviolet light being used to excite either minerals in spectacular ways or exciting fluorescent plastics or dyes such as the pigments found within fluorescent highlighters. We also learnt about activators, ions which can replace a proportion of calcium ions within the calcium carbonate crystal lattice. A common activator is the manganese ion Mn2+. However, we can visualize other activators which are also responsible for fluorescence in certain minerals, such as the lanthanides, otherwise known as the rare earths. To see this fluorescence, we must use a different excitation wavelength, in this case, 523 nanometer green laser light. This image shows the 523 nanometer laser entering from the right hand side. The beam isn't encountering any defects within the crystal, so we just see the red fluorescence. An interesting phenomena can also be seen other than the red fluorescence when the laser is off. Comment below your answer.